Hello and welcome. Welcome to a very, very special Vandal vlog. It's special because I actually bothered to make one this year. Well, it's not that I actually bothered. I have actually got three videos in the making, but uh, everything that I own is broken. So, here's a little video. It's just, I'm going to see a job. Oh, I've actually already seen it. And uh, I just thought it'd be cool to put on video and then uh, at least give you guys 10 or 15 minutes of Bodacious content because there's nothing else out there to watch except for the other million channels that uh, are street scrapping at the moment. But yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoy. Here's a house clearance. but that's not the house that we're clearing what we're actually going to clear has nothing to do with the house everything needs to go through that garage I haven't seen this yet so it should be cool rear access everything needs to go through the garage and this is the first building that needs to go it's metal everything Everything must go. I mean the builder, not the contents. So everything else in here is staying, but we're taking down the actual structure, the walls, roof, obviously, everything. It is a full demo. Bit of metal, obviously some wire. There's not a lot of metal in there. Even the skylight's a timber frame. It's had an asbestos survey and that passed okay. Quote, also to include the floor or footings. Not sure about the pavements and stones, blocks. Big tiles. I would presume block paving as well, which there is quite a lot. Includes this structure. Small conservatory. Access is right down there through the garden, so I'll have to get a dumper in. This is the second structure. It's basically a house. It's basically a bungalow. So this whole thing needs to go. Paving, everything up. Well, let's hope that has to go. Uh, I presume that's the, uh, the customers. Lots of plasterboard. didn't make it. Obviously electrics and plumbing needs to come out. Along with it. It's quite the building. Let's go outside again. So pillar structures. Roof structure. Not 
to include the fencing, obviously that's the border with the uh, neighbours. Oh, this needs to go. More roof tiles. What's that down there? Guttering? Yeah. It is quite the building. So we'll see your main electrics box. We'd have to oscillate that, obviously, because that must run down. Oh, yeah. Lead. It's just something. The only problem is we've got quite a lot of distance to go to the house. It's really not a lot of metal. Maybe it's a big enough job. This must be where to get the power from. And then the access is from there. get a one and a half ton digger through it. That's not good. power supply. Um, boiler. Could be a less water price than that one actually. It's probably a decent one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We'll definitely have that out.
Yeah, so I just spoke to the owner and uh, all this needs to go as well. Like it's a big property. Well, it's not, but it's, it's big enough. It's probably them now. Dee -dee 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 -dee. It's absolutely a lot. Up there, but you know, it's not worth the whole house, is it? <laughs> Patio structure. Uh, really don't know. Let me know where to start with this one, to be honest with you. It's bigger than the last one that I looked at, and that was a big one. Right, I'm on my way back. So I had to cut that one short because the customer came home. Uh, I didn't know if she wanted to be on camera or not. She did give me permission to film it. Um, so yeah, so basically with that job, it's gonna be um, it's gonna be a labor only. So we've agreed with the customers that they would get the skips in and stuff and I'll just need to get someone in to uh, disconnect the electrics, gas and water. And then basically give her a labor charge and I'll make a little bit extra just for just for managing the job. So uh, yeah, I need to go home and write that kite up. I really want this job. It's a great little job. It'd be a lovely videos. But I'll have to let you know. But I know you guys are wondering where I am. Look, I'm still here. I'm still alive. It's just we've we've had some issues, uh, money issues, and YouTube issues, and privacy issues. Uh, we have problems with the van and I've had problems at my place as well so uh, I don't want to get into it at the moment because I'm driving but I just wanted to put up this little video oh I've also had some technical issues my laptop's pretty much dead and this GoPro like, even before I turned this camera on I had to take the battery out and put it back in so it's doing that it's not the battery because I keep changing the batteries anyway I'll make a video coming up soon and when I say soon what I actually mean is sometimes in the future when I get a chance to finish them explaining what's going on while I've retired from street scrapping I'll let you into a secret there's no money in street scrapping there's no money in uh, house clearance either unless you're taking a house but uh, yeah uh, it's not just about the money there's some other stuff as well there's a uh, there's some stuff's been going on and it's uh, it's pissing me off and it's not good for my mentality or my health uh, you know trying to think of creative ways to torture people for touching your van is uh, it's not the, it's not the best way to spend your day anyway until the next one, which hopefully won't be too long, I'll, uh, I'll see you then, and uh, thanks for being patient. Thank you for your comp continual support. Yada, yada, yada. I'll let you know how the job goes. Until then, be cool, be kind, love. And uh, I'll see you next time on Vandal Vlogs, Chapter 2.